My name is Lars Kluwer. I'm the president of the Worldwide Views Alliance. If you think it is important what citizens from all over the world think about climate change policy, and you think it is important what will be decided at the COP15 negotiations in Copenhagen, then I have an important message for you. Citizens from all over the world in the Worldwide Views project said that they want strong and fast action in Copenhagen. The message from the citizens is summarized in this policy report, and it is clear. They want a deal to be made at COP15 with a long-term goal of no more than 2 degrees Celsius. But how do they want that to happen, and which decisions do they want COP15 to make? 1. The citizens say that technology should be made available to everyone. And they even suggest solutions such as open source technology, limited intellectual property rights, or transfer of capacity and technology from rich countries to poor countries. Two, make strong international institutions. The citizens want institutions that can monitor compliance and punish non-compliance. Some even talk about a global climate court. When it comes to financing, the citizens prefer an automatic mechanism, like for example a tax, instead of voluntary contributions. 3. Everyone should contribute to reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Industrialized countries, fast-growing economies, and poor countries. The citizens from all three groups are willing to contribute to greenhouse gas reductions. The lesson of worldwide views is as simple as it is surprising. When citizens receive thorough information about what is at stake at COP15, when they get time to consider their opinions, and when they get an opportunity to exchange views with other citizens, then they are willing to go much further than what standard polls indicate. And they are also willing to go much further than what is at the table at the COP15 negotiations. I think that is worth taking to Copenhagen.